Let's clear the cache on your iPhone. Now, if your iPhone is running slowly and you wanted to clear the cache, you wanted to free up some space, I'm gonna walk you through those steps. But first, there's a caveat to that. Apple is really good at managing the cache on your iPhone. If one app is using too much, it will dump the cache for that app and allocate it towards an app that you're currently using. So it constantly juggles that around and manages it pretty well. But if your iPhone is running slowly, especially if it's an older iPhone, you can always clear the cache I'll show you a few different options. Let's hop into settings here and we will scroll down and tap on general and then iPhone storage. Now here it gives you the ability to offload any apps and then reinstall them. This is a really good way to clear and dump the cache for that specific app. Keep in mind, this doesn't do it for all of the apps unless you go through and do it for all the apps, but you can say on TikTok here, I can hit offload this app and then I can just reinstall it. That will help to clear the cache on TikTok that's using a bunch of data. Now this is one option. One way to do it for all of the apps on your iPhone is just to do a force restart on your iPhone. So this will basically shut down all of the apps, everything on your iPhone and reboot everything. This will free up all of the cache. So let's tap and hold the volume up and the power button. And then we're just gonna slide to power off. Now, if you don't necessarily have the ability to slide to power off, you can just keep holding that power button. And if you hold it long enough, it will basically force shut down your phone and then you can restart it after that. Now, there are a few other places that cache is stored on your phone. We can always go back here, go back and go back again. And then I'm gonna just scroll down until we get to Safari. On here, you can scroll down and hit clear history and website data. And you can clear all of this. It says all of your cookies, browsing data, history, all of that stuff. It will help clear that up and again, make everything run a bit more smoothly and better. Now, there are some options in terms of specific apps that have the ability to clear the cache within that app itself. And let's go out here and TikTok is one of them. Snapchat is one of them as well. Let's tap on the profile at the bottom right, and then the three lines at the top right. Now let's tap on settings and privacy here. And if we scroll down, you can see under cache and cellular, there's the option to free up space. So I can tap on that, and it says here I have both cache and downloads. I can clear either one of those, the cache and the downloads, and this will help to free up a bunch of space on your app and basically free up space on your phone, help it run a bit better and more smoothly. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below, and I'll catch you on the next one.